Welcome back. Actually, let me make sure my settings are good. Audio. Voice chat's off. Okay, no one can hear me. So, here's some thoughts on the uh, Black Ops 6 campaign. I'm not sure how I like, if I liked it. Some of it was really fun and immersive. And the other side was just like half horror. Game. Like some of that, that, di that didn't really even feel like a Call of Duty game towards the end. It felt like, uh, You're clear to engage no, as I said, a literal horror game. I don't like how zombies was part of the story. I, I hate that. It's unclear if Case even lives at the end. I should tell you, okay, yeah, spoilers, obviously. So if you have not played it and want to, I this is going to sound cruel, but I don't really know why you would. I do not like it one bit. I, you know what, that's my, that's my, I'm just going off, like, instinct here. I did not like that campaign. I was so excited. I love Call of Duty campaigns so much. I think they're, like, when they're well made, it is, it like, you know, you get into it. Modern Warfare does a great job of that. Modern Warfare uh, 2019. Same with Modern Warfare 2, like, the part where you're going in the truck. Or, I'm sorry, you fall out of the helicopter. Like, that was legitimately, like, scary. Oh, hello. Got someone. I don't know where... Oh, I am. Right here. One second. Sixteen. You're losing ground. Gotcha. Wait, he's a cluster mine. Taking that, sir. Thank you. Anyways, uh, what was I saying? Yeah, like, Modern Warfare 2 was great. That campaign, I loved it. Um, Modern Warfare 3's campaign, I don't know if I liked it. I, You know what? No. I, At the time, I said I loved it, but now that I, like, look back, and I, and I played it um, before I played the Black Ops 6 campaign, not so I would have something to compare it to, but just so I could be like, okay... Maybe there's something to expect. Then again, it's you know Black Ops and Modern Warfare are different. Enemies are obviously. Into the area. Watch the skies. Hold up. Oh, he's back for more. Requesting fire mission. Target marked. Copy that. Mortar strike inbound. All right, that'll force them indoors so I can move. Interesting strategy there. I feel like he's gonna... Oh, well, that's not where I wanted it to go. Oh, there you go. Shit. Well, at least I know where he is. Fuck. I hit him. Oh my god! What the hell? Oh, there's someone else. This ain't training camp. It's Damn the it. gulag. And you're gonna have to fight to earn redeployment. And it wasn't very smart of me. Let's see. Gulag here, I don't know. Fuck, yeah, I... That didn't go well. So, anyways, Black Ops 6 campaign, it was confusing. It was too much. I, well, I don't want to say too much. Yeah, it was too much. The one mission, was it hunting season or hunting party or something? No, hunting parties in uh, Modern Warfare 19. Hunting season. That was like, that was just not, it wasn't fun. There was so, it was such a big map. It felt like Warzone, but you're just playing against bots. Well, not even that. You have like a team that barely helps you and they're, you know, the, the AI, or they're pretty stupid, which was nice. Um, the first time I played through a campaign, I always have it on either Recruit or Regular. Just because I don't want to like, I don't want to get all frustrated about it. 
if it's really tough. So I, I just want to get through it. I just want to see what it's like. And then I'll go back. And that's what I did. Actually, no, Modern Warfare 3, I played that. I think I did that at Hardened the entire time. So that was nice. Um, yeah, I mean, there's just, it, it's a bad campaign. It isn't fun. It is sort of immersive. It's not something I would recommend. Cold War's campaign was great. Here's the thing. I don't get why the Black Ops games... I mean, I know it, they've always done this where it's like, a, you know, you go into the mind. And I, I think it's kind of cool. But at the same time, like... I don't know. I, I don't know. Like, that campaign was just exhausting. And I wanted it to get it over with. Check your gear and weapons. We'll be deployed it wasn't... Shortly. I'm going to say it. it well, I'm going to give it a 3 out of 10. It was not good. There's different reasons. I've listed some of them, but there's so many more. Uh, for example, like, it had aspects of, you know, like, it had, yeah, I got you six. like, it had, um, you know, armor plates. So I think that was good. I liked that. That, obviously, that wasn't in Cold War. That was in... Wow, look at Enemy that lag. There was, the um... All stations. This is Zero <sighs> what am I trying to say? The there was armor plates in Modern Warfare 3. I liked that a lot. That was really cool. The open combat missions, though, I loved at first, and then... I tried to... I honestly just played it to get all of the achievements after and kind of just explore the map. It wasn't great. It wasn't well developed. It was, like, extremely rushed. That's what makes this one so hard, like, that's what makes this one so upset, not upsetting, just so, like, depressing to play through. And the reason is that they had so long to make, a, I mean, they could have made a way, 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 way better campaign. The part where the gas gets to you, like, you go down that elevator shaft, I mean, I won't spoil this for you. I mean, it doesn't really fucking matter. Because it's a terrible campaign. I do not recommend it. Save your time and save your money. Anyways, the part where this gas gets you, it's like Secure Five Nights Freddy Security Breach. Have you ever played that? And specifically, it's like the part where you're in the basement and the, the endoskeletons, if you turn your back to them, they move. That's. They, they legitimately copied that. It's the exact same thing, it's, it's not endoskeletons. No, no. It's, um, mannequins. It's the same fucking thing. I, I don't get it. Yeah, what was it? Four years? Jesus, this lag is gonna bother me, dude. I don't want to see it for it. I'll store it. I don't get it. I'm honestly just gonna play Modern Warfare 3 online. I don't give a shit. The online for Black Ops 6 is horrible. It's literally just nothing but sliding. Well, that's incorrect. It's just nothing. Holy shit, this lag is bad. It's nothing but like just a bunch of like sweats running. Oh fuck, see, I wasn't paying attention. Though. Running around the map. Oh, I want highlight. Um. Sliding everywhere, killing you by like diving, which is just annoying. I don't know why they put what is I think it's the Omni movement. Terrible idea. It was, that, it was a terrible idea. That whole game was a terrible idea. Now that I say it out loud, I mean I'm realizing that their campaign was awful. And it sucks that I, I, I didn't want to say that. You know, when I played through it, I was I was holding out. I was hopeful. Like, may, okay, maybe this will get better. Maybe it'll be like a realistic, you know, sort of combat. But it didn't. The, the suppo I don't even really know who the bad guy was. Well, I guess it was the whatever faction that was. Like, elite, no, what are they called? Pantheon or something. It was, 
odd. Like, that's literally the only way I can describe it. It was just odd. And this, and Jane, Harrow, in the beginning, she's like, I'll bail you guys out. I, you know, and then I think that was her. Yeah. Because, like, if it was, then you would never have seen that person again. It was Harrow. So you find out she's, like, working with the bad people. And then you go into a traumatic past. Oh, shit. someone coming in. Well, that was a terrible shot. Try to throw them off. I just wanted to get away from them. I'm gonna toss the decoy as well. Pick it in the cash register. Come on. I just, it's, it wasn't the campaign I wanted it to be. It wasn't what I thought it would be. I was really excited. The advertisement and the hype for this game was huge. I think maybe the most I've ever seen for a Call of Duty game. So, that's why I was, it was when it was a letdown, I just, I don't know, it really frustrates me. Alright. Got my loadout now. That's nice. Probably have enough for a UAV. Oh, no, I don't. Alright, well, I'm gonna get a munitions then. Well, I guess that medic best wouldn't matter. Gas is closing in. Get to the new safe zone. I'm trying to go for this most wanted thing. Keep your eyes up for prime oh, there he contracts. Is. You'll earn more buck for your bag. Okay, I got a hit on him. You know what? I'm gonna send a breacher after him. Oh, I got an assist. Okay, so the most wanted's down. Killer was somewhere over here. You know what? I'm gonna wait, because I bet you he'll go for the box. If I had to guess, he's probably gonna go for the crate. Maybe not. Hmm, I don't know what to do right now. Oh, yeah, there he is. He's going for it. I should have made, I should have hit literally every single one of those shots. And now I don't know where he is. Oh, it appears someone else is helping me. Oh, shit. Yeah, he was too far away now. over there. Is this rock for cover? Man, I need electrolytes right now. After this game, I gotta gotta get myself some electrolytes. And I'm not talking about Gatorade. No, no, the Gatorade's bad. Gatorade makes me feel sick, actually. If I drink it, I feel like I'm gonna throw up. That did happen once, so I can never drink it again. 
It was always after like basketball games when I was a kid. There was a concession stand, and I would get a Gatorade after we all would. And then, but after running around a lot, it's a really bad idea. I don't know if anybody else says that. It could just be me. It's too bad. I keep thinking I've, um... Oh, jeez. Yep, that's the building I want. Oh, wow. I just got that. Alright. Ooh, hello. Yeah, I gotta be careful here. Oh, no fucking way! Gas is moving in. What? That could have been bad. Oh, he was level two. And God, wow, well, that is extremely is cool nice. Where you fight to win redeployment. Oh, gosh, that's embarrassing. <laughs> wow. All right. Fuck you. God damn it. Return to base. The enemy took that one, but we'll get him back. Well, please 45th. That is embarrassing. Oh, and I was his first kill, of course. Ah, that's going to do it for this one. Just wanted to talk about my thoughts on the campaign and the online multiplayer. Both campaign, I think I gave it a 3 out of 10. Multiplayer, 1 out of 10. I've only played a few games and I hate it. Uh, one out of, Actually, you know, let's be nice, 1.5 out of 10. Anyway, that's about it. I'll be uh, back in the next one, I guess. Probably later, but I need a break.